Alright guys, it's Flay from Boxing Evolution TV. I'm just here with or Ollie Lawrence and he was boxing he was boxing tonight against uh, what was his name again? Daryl Davidson. That's it, Daryl Davidson. Uh, so you got the win there, it looked like a uh, you were dancing around a lot, using your footwork and your head movement to avoid his punches. Yeah, I mean I had to get straight on my feet because obviously he was he was strong, uh, come on quite strong, so I knew I had to get on the bike straight away. Um, and it, I underestimated him, I thought he wasn't gonna be as strong as he was, but he came out and he was determined, he got himself into a good shape. Obviously he heard about my last fight, my knockout, so obviously he wanted to put some hours in, in the gym. And yeah, I just got on my bike, worked on the jab, um, and yeah, just got the win, man. Did you know much about him before you before tonight? Um, I, all I know is that he won his last fight against, um, I forget the fella's name now, but he won the fight and uh, he dropped him. So therefore I knew he was going to bring some ammunition. But yeah, just trained hard, mate. Trained hard and got the win. So that's the main thing. That's the main thing. But it definitely looked like a bit of a battle. Definitely some some exchanges. But in the end, it looked like your footwork and your head movement, and uh, it seemed like you were doing a lot of rolling and in and out of the corners and stuff like that. So. Yeah, that's sort of thing. I'm, I mean, I, I'm gonna really try and step up my fitness now. I try and like, I try try my hardest to implement my rolls. Um, and uh, yeah, basically just just try and get my head moving as much as possible, really. So yeah, happy days. Okay, well, I'm looking forward to seeing you box again. Um, so I believe that you were uh, in the amateurs before this. You had 15 fights. Yeah, I had 15 amateur fights. One nine, lost six. Um, yeah, and then I started. I started back up again when I was about 17. Um, this is my eighth fight back, um, and I've won all of them. So it's happy days. Okay, so you've had two fights on the Queensbury Boxing League. Yeah. I mean, are you not going to go back to the amateurs now? Um, do you know what? This feels like home now, the Queensbury. Um, it's, it's just it's just a good atmosphere. It's a, amazing people. Uh, everyone in the crowds is here for the boxing. You know, it's just such a good vibe. So I think I'm going to stick with Queensbury because that's the way that it seems to be going right now. Okay, and where do you see your future going? Are you just going to stick with the Queensbury League and then you know progress into something else, or are you aiming to turn pro at some point? I mean, obviously, my my goal in life is to to be a professional boxer. Um, so yeah, I'm going to try and stick on the Queensbury to as long as it takes and then if this if the op if, if if it occurs to me to go, for me to go pro then obviously I'll dive on it but until then I'm just going to stick with Queensbury do you think this platform the way it's set up with you know all the big camera crews and the lighting and everything helps you get used to the pro scene as opposed to the amateur shows uh, yeah it definitely definitely like represents a professional show definitely um, and yeah it's, it, it sets you up for that big show if you if for that big fight if you was to go pro it, it would sort of like you know Gear you up for something like that, definitely, yeah, 100%. Okay, well, this is Ollie, Lawrence. Lo Ollie Lawrence, yeah. okay, future pro boxer, and he's pro Queensbury Boxing League. Favourite Boxing Sorry, Evolution Sorry. TV, over and out.